Okay, so here is Bash Dash and Thomas. Uh, I just put Thomas out to show the size. And Bash, I believe, put the magnet to magnet. Bash is bigger. Wait, no, Thomas is. Okay. <clears throat> well, anyway, let's move on. Uh, very good quality engines, I have to admit. Really great quality. Uh, dash on the bottom. Bash is a 9 out of 10. Dash is an 8 out of 10. Let me show you why. Both of them have the logging wheel that spins. But, as it says here, a logging wheel spins. Yes. Okay. I thought it was when they moved. Which is a bummer that it doesn't. You have to hit it with your finger. And I see how this could be used. Put the log or something goes chop 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 into the bunker because I guess they need smaller logs for the bunkers so that's why Bash is a 9 out of 10 Dash becomes an 8 out of 10 because uh, same thing and he's defective so he's got a little defect there factory fault um, but overall these are really good characters really well detailed um, everything there Smiling face, domes, lamps, and they have really good faces. They look extremely fun for the kids to play with, and just everything like that. So, overall, 9 out of 10 for Bash, 8 out of 10 for Dash. And, uh, my total rating. For all three of these guys is uh, probably a nine out of ten, cause they all have their little defects here and there, but you know they're good. They're really good detail, very good detail. My my compliments to Learning Curve, really great. Um, they have their little defects here and there, ailments. So, yeah, really good. And, um, uh, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. And, uh, anyway, as I was saying, it's a really good quality compliments to learning curve and all that. Um, in total, 9 out of 10. Really good models. And here's some announcements. Be on the lookout for these in my upcoming episodes. But here's something about my episodes. I'm taking down the basement layout altogether. Uh, I might put it right here with the boxes and everything. Or in my room. Because I'm getting a brand new room and a brand new bed. So I can put a trundle or something under my bed and have the layout there. Depends. But, um, right now, I think I might do one last episode in the basement. So, it's not going away entirely. And, uh, oh, for you Bullstrode, people who have wooden Bullstrode, wait, did I already say this? Yes, I already said this, didn't I? Yes, I already said it. Um, wait, no, for Bullstrode people, I'm going to say it again. Just um, put in the comments section below if the captain is bigger or smaller than your bolstrode in all ways. Just put that in the comments section below. Thank you. And anyway, oh, another thing. I don't think I already said this, but be on the lookout for Olympic Tales of Old Reliable trailers right down there by the Olympics bow. And just be on the lookout for the brand new movie. Feature film. Feature length movie, I like to call it. And uh, I think that's all I have to say. So be on the lookout for my Ferdinand review, which is coming up soon. Because I'm getting a Ferdinand off eBay. Um, he's coming. So, uh, yeah. He should be here anytime soon. 
So this is my review of three of the four of the Misty Island Rescue characters. Bash, yes Bash, Dash, and Captain. This is M. Twelman, signing off. Ha 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 ha!